Before you start your search in the new Hudox search engine, please note that when opening the database, the default settings show you the Grand Chamber and Chamber Judgments in order of the latest judgment published. Use this field to perform a search in one or more of the Hudoc document collections. You can search by entering a single word, phrase, sentence, case title, application number, or state. Click on Search to find your results. Boolean operators can also be used. For example, you can use the proximity Boolean operator near by typing hot water near prism. This allows you to find documents containing certain words that are near to each other. To help you formulate more complex searches, a table is available in the Hudoc user manual that details the wide range of searching syntax that the portal understands and provides practical examples of its use. Should you make a spelling mistake, the search will not return any results. However, it will suggest other words that you can use. For example, if you mistype the word violence, the system suggests the right word. Click on your chosen suggestion in blue and you get the expected result. You can narrow your search by document collection. On the left-hand side of the screen, you can choose which case law collections you want to search in. You can search for any type of document in the collection, including communicated cases and legal summaries. You can easily narrow down your search with these filters. The results screen will be modified each time you use a filter. The number of documents is indicated in brackets. For example, you can select Judgments, Grand Chamber and Chamber, State, United Kingdom, click on More if it does not appear in the list, and Violation of Article 6. You then have a list of these search criteria used at the top of your result list. You can remove these search criteria by clicking on Clear All, which will take you back to the default settings. You can use the language filter to search by document language. When you click on More, a box will show you the complete list of languages available in alphabetical order and with the number of documents available in brackets. The Sort By box gives you these four options. Let's choose Italian. You can also select the importance level. Cases are divided into four categories the highest level of importance being case reports. More details about the importance categories can be found here and in the Hudoc user manual. Let's select case reports. You can select other options in the various filters including violation and non-violation. You can then select more under these filters and choose, for example, violation of Article 6. You can narrow your search by using the keywords filter. For example, you can drill down on keywords linked to Article 6, or you can make a search by typing in the word proceedings to visualize all the articles that are linked to that keyword. Click on the case title to open the view box of the case. Here, you'll be able to read the text by scrolling up and down, maximize and minimize the screen, email the document link, print the document, download the PDF version, and download the Word version of the document.